Yay! Anda kamu? Hola. Que pasa? Uh, bien. Madre. <laughs> God. <laughs> I like it when you wear a tie. ஒரேட்டிங் <laughs> <laughs> Let's say you met your first uh, like good uh, like girlfriend. Yeah? <laughs> what? My friend? No. Yeah, your girlfriend. Girl was a friend. No, you couldn't have any girl properly. Yeah, that's all. I mean, 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 I ஒன்ஸ்டாண்ட் <laughs> Tamil. Your marketing is very good. That brand, how you got it is very good. I'm yeah. just wondering how you explain it to mom. Oh, it's like, it's like, do you, do you want to come? Like, do you want to come for a party? Oh, <laughs> like. <laughs> I mean, that's how I actually, like, ask her, like, like, when I message her, like, do you want, like, it's not, I'm not doing it on purpose. Like, mm. I'm not, like, using the word so they will know and everything. I'm legit, like, I'm messaging, like, I know you don't want it. <laughs> no, 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 no. That everyone knows. That everybody knows. But I'm saying generally when you when you speak or like like when I'm just asking do you want to come it just comes out naturally you know when everybody knows like the first thing like whoever has asked me the next was the mind was there or the then or the yeah, yeah, then you have to explain yeah. so and I always must have explained to him now but then I thought it's a very good strategy because he's in you know, there thinking about wanna come yeah. and not about the no oh, I'm not what and then it's it's english also so it's good mm-hmm. so it's like both tamil with english and So all my audience will understand, right? Bye. Yeah. You start? It's already started, bro. It's started? Yeah. Yay! And come. Welcome. Thank you, Al. Shame. Oh, what has your old times? Oh, just my old times. Just my old times. But you're very tired all now, man. I just do it like, I like when I go to the office, but nobody else missed. You're the only one. Like, you know, I was in Bombay and I used to wear a tie. So first day I wore a tie. And then I went. And then everyone was like, no one wears tie. Uh, only director of all wears tie. Uh, so I removed it. But I always liked, liked wearing ties. Um, so that's why I also came here. I made sure like, I'll go to work next. I'll wear tie. Yeah. So no one wears tie. I like it when you wear a tie. Free sort. Oh, sorry. PG rated. Oh, yeah, PG rated. Yeah. PG rated. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Yeah. Yeah. One weekend. Uh, cut. Cut. And then casting couch. No, no, no. This is a casting couch? So what you're saying? It's really waiting for you. That's why the camera is cut only over here. They don't know what's over there. <laughs> Casting couch. Casting couch is only till this. Yes, only this one particular couch. This guy is like Maria Chu. We were in a relationship for... No, no, they've been for... <laughs> we were staying together as two brothers for uh, two years in Mumbai, India. Where did you? Huh? Where you said? Danu Karwadi. Yeah. Hashtag Danu Karwadi. Danu Karwadi. It's one of the best places in Mumbai. Must visit. Can't do any best. That's right. 10 minutes from the uh, Malad uh, station. Eh. Can't do any station. Sorry, man. I was thinking of college. It's 10 minutes to college. Sorry. It was 10 minutes to college. How is your Hindi not? Very good. What? Anyone speak to Hindi? Yes, man. Very good. What? Very good. Okay. What did you say? मेरे को हिंदी मालूम है पता है बस में में दुकान पूरा पूरा हिंदी मेरे बाकी पॉडकास्ट हम हिंदी में बात ओ आई पुट सबटाइटल नो टॉकिंग टॉकिंग 
Do you remember how you were when you first came? I was too good. It was so bad. What do you mean I was so bad? He was so bad. And he, then he improved a lot towards the end. But he was always good, man. What do you mean improve? I can always communicate. Come on. Maybe, yeah, you can always communicate. Then what is? It's got better. I feel in Barcelona has got better. Because I'm talking much. But seriously, you speak them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because everyone in the supermarket, or like Bakala over there, on the small, small supermarkets, they're all from Pakistan, Bangladesh, India. So when I see them, I, I don't go and talk in English or in Spanish. I don't know. So how do you know they're from... Where are the ways? Race is caught in the act. Guys, caught in snippet. Make a shot. This is, this is, race is caught in the act. Do you think I think we didn't talk much Hindi? Because you don't want to talk. You don't want to talk to the world. So we we were together for six months, locked up. Locked house. In, yeah, during the lockdown in India during he COVID. He was the first one who taught me. He like he was the first one who taught me to cook. Remember the chapati ma? I did teach you. you, you I, me, saw, I saw my first cooking <laughs> YouTube video in my life, and then I did it. I think like, why does it? It was basically flour and water. <laughs> I mixed it together. That's all. And he's like, oh, so so. Ooh, so during, I think before full lockdown, I I used to keep still ordering. Yeah. And then you decided one day like I'm going to stop ordering all of a sudden, and you just started going to cook. No. Yeah, that's how you started cooking. The the this thing stopped. The all the. No, the lockdown was there. Like it was there, and then I used to still eating. Start eating outside. But they stopped delivery for like this 15 days yeah, or something. That, you, but you started before that, okay? No, I should. I yeah. remember starting to cook because they stopped delivery. That's why. That's what I have in mind. My, my mind was that. I told the story so different to everyone. My mind was that you wanted to be safe and everything, and you didn't want to eat. Not yeah. <laughs> okay. So I used to keep ordering outside. Uh, that time I used to go to office, no. Yeah. Before lockdown started. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Before yeah. lockdown started. Yeah. Like lockdown started around like March fifteenth of yeah. Like that. Yeah. So I used to keep eating on set. I think you started like already before that. No, no. Okay, no. Okay, I did start cooking that time, but it was that Maggi upma. I didn't make all this chapati and all these fancy fancy items. I didn't make. But I don't. I made very simple like this bread and all. I used to make with some uh, with tomato and all some random things. I used to make. Yeah. Very simple dishes. I used to make that time. True. But do you remember when uh, the lockdown and you went to D Mart? Yeah. Night. Yeah. That's the first day I started cooking. Ah. But you started cooking before that. Yeah, but then I think before that was all these simple dishes is what I'm saying. Yeah. I used to cook. Not like this cha- chapati no, I never made that time. Chapati no, I That's still still my mom. That first time you made chapati, it turned into kimchi. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, you made, you put, I don't know what reason you put so much oil into your vessel. You know that similar vessel you have? You know, you never let you use chicken in that. Yeah, obviously. But at the end, I used to put chicken in that. Yeah, I know. Because you were not here. And he had a yellow plate also there. You know why? Because... But at the end, I had to throw it here. So when I moved from nesting to... And I moved from Danukhevai uh, to other house, I took it with me. Yeah, yeah. And coming back here, I thought... Yeah, yeah, yeah. How much you take and come? You were honestly like, thinking back here, yeah, like those six months, we were just alone. Really, now that I think that, it was such peaceful at home. Like, obviously, work outside, there was COVID and was all worrying and all that, but... I really enjoyed you know, spending that time with you. And she, yeah, I think yeah, I got bond a lot with you that time. Thanks, sir. What do you want to go meet up? Oh, man. My audience, bro. <laughs> my audience, there are under 18 people. My family are watching this, man. What do you think of us? It's so hard to talk to you in... Yeah. Like, wait, wait, wait. What do you mean? What do you mean? <laughs> it's so hard to talk to you in like PG language, da. Because we were born and brought up in like Boetic language. All of us, all, all Addis people, especially after 12, after 10th grade. Oh, oh my God. But yeah, I think really that, that, uh, that six months, I, I got to bond a lot with you, even though I was obviously still with you, but I really felt your like, presence after you left. Mm. Like, like, shit, like, he's not there, and that kind of presence. Even though I like, you were like, sorry, sorry, I'm going, I'm, I don't believe you, I don't believe you. I was like, thinking, oh, the fuck, bro, why you want to be, you can go, it's fine. Mm. But then after you left, I'm like, oh, shit. The guy wrote the isolation thing and thing. And then, sorry bro, you felt nice bad after that man. But I feel very bad I left you, but I didn't have choice. That's true. <laughs> you went to Vasa directly from there? Oh, I, came back. I came here, I stayed for like one year and then I went. I remember, you know, uh, the day you left to Vasa, from here? Yeah. You were like, I want to show you something, I want to show you something. And I came to show you, I know, I'll call you. I was planning on calling you the day you were leaving. But thing I couldn't call something happened, like we can call. So then you told me that I'll reach there and I'll call you. I want to see your live reaction. And I'm like, oh, come on. When you, when you reached, you called me, we talked and all. 
And they were like, okay, wait, I want to see your reaction to something. Like, you don't remember? I don't, tell me. I mean, I'm waiting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then you sent me a picture of you in the toilet full, oiled up, full jacked. And she just flips it like... I still remember that picture, bro. I mean, like, we were full jacked and I went, we are way up. Where did this come from? That was not the sense that you left Mumbai and then went there. Yeah, I went to gym for like four months and I became like... That was very good for four months, yeah, bro. I think, no, no, for, for six months, sorry. For six months. Six months I went and it was really good. For six months? Like I lost weight and I also... Like, you were muscle, yeah. yeah. No, also the oil and the yellow light obviously <laughs> enhanced it like double maybe. But yes, I did uh, I did put on some uh, good gains. Yeah, I'm at the time. Yeah. Yeah, but those six months in the COVID in India was very nice. Um, yeah, yeah, was was very fun. I feel especially when I turn on camera, some instances what we did. I can't tell you I was like, <laughs> oh, you don't care. Yeah, then if your family watches, there's so many unwanted stuff we did. Yeah, I feel so many unwanted stuff. No, I feel like I can't. I can't it. think about it now, bro. I can't like I can't think about it. Actually, I can't say anything. Actually, this this episode is like I can't say anything. <laughs> you know I mean? It's like I don't know what. No, it's like I have so many things to talk. Yeah, but I can't say. Anything. Yeah, I can't. Like I used to do. I think openly I used to do everything. I think I used <laughs> yes. to do openly everything. Like that's like in short. Like I never I used to like, openly work also. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. I have I used to take laptop that. inside. No. <laughs> yeah. Oh damn! And I used to put the stool in there sometimes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, put the stool, yeah, the stool so you can keep the laptop or the stool yeah. so don't get to it. Oh, what an intrusion, man! What are your uh, memories about Bombay? That only. <laughs> <laughs> that is what the that one day in in Nested when we stayed before the apartment. Nested, we didn't we didn't uh, do to get free. Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. I'm talking like this one day when you just. Puked. Oh yeah, I think he got food poisoning that day. It was too much. <laughs> too much food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That bad day too food. much. Bad food. Bad, very bad food that day. Yeah, yeah. So he got food poisoning. Did you still speak to him? And uh, contacts with him? Yeah, like I don't talk like constantly. If he replies something, I do. He messaged uh, that he got job. He's changing his job. Yeah, I think he's a very nice guy. Yeah. Very gentleman. Very nice farm. Yeah. He used to just eat waffles for breakfast. Waffles. Like, so it used to be three of us, me, Achu and Arvind, we used to stay together in this apartment. And I think right before COVID, he just slept. So the six months, the house was just for the both of us, basically. Uh, but when he was also there, it was very chill. We used to play FIFA all the time. Oh, he used yeah. to order, like, waffles with ice cream for breakfast. He used to love dal makhi and all that. Yeah. He used to like dal makhi. Yeah. I, I, first time, I... And he's not vegetarian. <laughs> And it was very really, like weird to see that he likes it. Yeah, I really I remember him like talking passionately about the Almakri and Nestin. Like when the first time we met him, no? Yeah. Like he was passionately talking about Nestin. Yeah, about uh, the Almakri. Like yeah. what? So I'm very happy to see you, da. What? Uh? How you're doing in Barcelona. It's, every time I see you, you ventures actually makes me very happy. Thank you, da. It's all, it's all because of you, bro. The reason I... How many I... co-venturers you have, like you have... <laughs> First, inside started the photography room. Once you went there, you started taking photos and you made clips of everything and then you started posting. I, when you got an iPhone, I, when you got an iPhone that time. Yeah. You started traveling a lot and then you started making videos. Yeah. With the background music and all. Very good. Right. Started with there. But the content creation was always there with you. Guys, check out the <laughs> first three videos. So I guess back. You're, you're used to me spitting, yeah? So it's okay. It's used to my style, yeah? But the worst thing, like, I'm, like, definitely with the cooking thing, bro. Uh-huh. Like, well, I don't know how shit you are at cooking. Uh-huh. Like, I'm meaning in a good way. Yeah, yeah, I know. It. Like, in a good way. And, like, responsibility-wise also, like, uh-huh. obviously, you were not that responsible, like, uh, when you were in Bombay. Yeah, I'm not responsible now. Oh, it's <laughs> that, no. No, no, okay, compared to Bombay, for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. even you, uh, even you were not yeah, but as responsible as I don't see, like, five years. a big jump, but yours, like, a big jump, bro. Like, you've become, you've become an entrepreneur. You started your own business, you have become a pod, you have your own podcast, you have your own... No, and see, no, no, it's you true. actually what entrepreneurs do, like they make business, they market this, they market the stuff, and you're doing that. No, it's true. And that's great. Thank you. It's just the hype is too much. I just have to make it that high. Hype is this? Too much, like, now you're seeing, yeah, for the last two minutes. <laughs> well, I'm just telling you what you are, your product is good. It's true, it's true, thank you. But I think it will take some time, you know, to reach that level of, uh, like, 
what is your like what do you want to gain from this in the podcast on the podcast yeah on the podcast actually um i want to bring the people who i know like into it especially like my friends okay into it. that's my main thing i never thought like i should get i don't know these many likes these many shares these many followers or uh, i don't know like they want to bring your it's, friends it's, it's, it's not for the it's not for the fandom basically the beginning i did it because i like to edit videos and stuff so it's because of that and then it was also like i know i have good content because i have people like you to come and then there's something to talk about okay so so what do you use right like see like this i doing in the i want i want i want other people to get to know all of you like all of you like whoever i can bring whoever says yes basically so it's not like i'm only bringing my very good my closest friends it's also people who i know for a while mm. or maybe someone who's talented if i can bring them i bring them as well you know like if uh, if they're good in some sport or something or some art or something i try bringing them just so that they also get exposure i also get exposure obviously and you're very easy to talk to also not because like like not just because i know you but you're very easy to talk to and eh? cuz you study psychology also oh john you want to hear what i've lost cut down cut <laughs> even though you say psychology yeah so he's like he's actually a uh, future of ca over here that's so he's wearing tie and everything over here huh? so he's he's a very very big person in this room no, no. very well educated guy no, no, no. we are more than very well same educated just little bit here i know more of finance you know more of uh, editing huh? cinema <laughs> graphy i'm editing yeah 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 i'm in the entertainment business he's in the finance uh, <laughs> and that's business yeah in the future uh, when you when you watch this podcast after 20 to 30 years he's going to be sitting in the parliament of india as the finance minister of uh, of our bharat thanks no worries bro i will i will vote for you okay. <laughs> i have make sure you play with me oh let's say that yeah, ah, yeah. okay yeah. but but don't give me excel sheet that <laughs> tally and i can't do that at least how about uh, so um, in the course you studied yeah won't it be like useful for you to get some job related to that now which course I studied? Sports <laughs> management. Ah, my my degree. Okay. <laughs> I forgot that you sports management so much. So let's see. Let's see what all you studied. No, no. So let's see what all you studied. So twelve, you took. What is it? Psychology. Which side? I got out of the gate. What? Twelve, you got. You took commerce with psychology. The mic is good. Okay. Okay. Then for for degree, you went to Middlesex. Psychology. Yeah. Yeah. How many years? One year. One year. Yeah. Okay. Then you came to Mumbai. Yeah. To study sports management. Yeah. Two years. Three years. Three years. Three years. I mean, one year was during this lockdown. Oh, so yeah. two years I was in, and that to one year only I went to college. The second year I was traveling for this internship and all that. But I went to Hyderabad, oh. and Orissa, and all these places. I totally forgot about that, man. Yeah. That was before COVID, yeah. Yeah, before COVID, yeah. Actually, till COVID I was outside for that year or whatever. Oh, I completely forgot about the internship you had. Yeah. I was not in the house for long. Yeah, you were not in the house. Yeah. 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 You used to come late. Yeah. You used to go. I I should not see you for a very long yeah. time actually. Yeah. I remember we didn't see each other for. We like... had three shirts. We used to wear every time. We used to wear that. This is and then you know we used to iron it because we used to wash it in such a way that once it's dry it's only in that. I don't know how you. But it works out. Oh. <laughs> it worked out. So how you did that? I'll teach you the technique. You take it. You squeeze it properly, and then you take it out like that, and then you. and then you put it in the hanger then just adjust it dry it and done i remember the first day you went there you sent me in from my that my room the mirror no yeah like a daily tv i know <laughs> i was wearing the red color shirt over right here yeah and then you have red you had a black and white yeah what black, yeah, black and gray yeah black and gray like a shiny one there yeah. i'm not sure to wear it every time these three shirts i had a blue one because i wore that after i became thin because I, i i became thin also no in that pack oh, yeah. you know i came like this but then i lost a lot of weight was the internship when i lost weight i wore this blue color shirt so i had these three shirts i used to keep rotating and that's how you met your first uh... <laughs> so i'm spitting on you i hear i hear you used to it that's right yeah yeah that's what yeah cuz you used to the spit yeah that's how you met your first uh, very good uh, very good friend yeah my <laughs> <laughs> friend bro yeah your good friend girl was over and no you i couldn't have any properly yeah that's oh i mean <laughs> <laughs> 
He's trying to get eyes out of me. Yeah. I don't like this conversation. Okay, I'm going to order a control door. It's so okay. Don't say this. Don't say that. Okay, that was a good one. Guys, just imagine I stayed with him for six months. Imagine what all I've seen. What? Imagine what all. He's six months. He stayed with him for two and a half years. No, no, no. No, no. Two and a half years. But then six months like properly without getting out. Yeah. That, that's what I meant. That's like. You know what was happiness? Then we used to order from D-Mart. We used to order from uh, Big Basket. Yeah. And we used to come down. Yes. Oh, man. I know. We took that. That uh, crate and we threw it on that bed. Bed and I just slept. Yeah, I slept on it. It was like chips, with chocolates chips and cookies. I can put all this photos down. Yeah. I think you're not very sure to that. <laughs> it's okay. I'm okay. thin in that. That's okay. Now, are you are you fat shaming yourself? No, I know I'm not shaming. I know I'm fat. I'm become fat. No, you don't become healthier. No, oh, I'm become fat. I'm just trying to become healthy now. Uh, I know I was. Palak paneer for you today. It's okay, it's like it's healthy dal. Oh, yeah, I palak. I don't put cream here. Yeah. Palak paneer is healthy. So we put it also. Uh, no. Eat while you are. No, if I eat while it feels thirsty, then I won't. I can't have palak paneer. The saying is, "Ablo, no amigo." Hola. ¿Qué pasa? Uh, bien. Madre. <laughs> God. <laughs> How you know all of this? Yeah. I am a poor oh shit. Uh, I am very common, yes. Oh, okay. How long was it? This I'll cut for sure. 100% I'm cutting. <laughs> Don't tell me I'm putting this wrong. No way I'm putting this wrong. Uh, what happened for Vasa fans? Yeah, like the club, I train with the club, no? They're all like prop, like they're like cool ass. Like, like... We scale Vasa. How is he playing that? Oh shit. Shit, this is three questions. This is requested. <laughs> this is requested. <laughs> I don't know how to answer it. Dude, you know the first time? Oh, yeah. I, I just completely... Guys, I, I can't... Uh, I can't put this right. Oh, it just came in my mind. Yeah, so the... You never used to pray and then what? I used to not pray, yeah. And then I... And then I... Prayed you know how you prayed? Yeah, yeah, I know. You know what prayed. caused you to pray? Yeah, I know. I, oh. I saw... I, I kind of saw God and <laughs> visions... <laughs> And uh, I, I, that guy was so creepy, bro. Yeah, the guy in the road. No, yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Yeah, that. Yeah. Yeah. But what about he's in the room, man? Yeah, yeah. I liked his mantras and chants. Like his voice and all was good. Is yeah, there? I'm talking about the other brain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How was your? And do you pray now? I'm, <laughs> yeah, I'm, not, I'm not talking about our playing. Man, I'm so shy, bro. <laughs> I'm not talking about our I've never got this shy. I've never got this shy. <laughs> okay, I'm not talking about our playing. I'm talking about in general. Like, oh, yeah. You know, never, like, uh, you never used to believe in like, going and praying. Yeah. Mm. You know, there was God is there and then you used to pray. No, no, no. I used to not believe that also. Oh. Yeah, that time, yeah. that time, I used to not believe. Like, okay. Yeah. Like, eight sisters. It's nothing, bro. Shoo, so, there's only, what, there's only Tala. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> That's true, now what's he said? What path are you on right now? I'm, um, I'm finding the path. Oh. <laughs> I'm finding the path, which is the right path. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. Yes. I've not uh, reached anywhere or, I don't know if it's the start. It's definitely not the finish line. Definitely not even the middle. Mm -hmm. I know it's somewhere in the, in the start. Yeah. So, like, what, what makes you think you're in the start? Just things happening around you, visions and um, people also surrounding you, the awareness. But on a very serious note, do you feel like there is like there's an ultimate power and uh, like there is something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There, there is there is something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know what like if it is some person or like who we pray to, like any religion. That that you no, know, I'm not that much into. But there is something for sure. Two hundred percent, I know that. That I, I'm, I'm sure of that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's that's fair. Yeah, my word, my version of God would be different. Your version of God would be different. That's no, not yeah. Oh, what is your version? Like I believe in the even though that man, so that's yeah, God, and yeah, the gods, the gods, the demigods. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So for me, the the God is the it can be for me. It's just like it can be Vishnu, in the Krishna, Krishna. For someone of Christianity, it can be Jesus. Yeah. For someone who believes in Islam, it can be Allah. Oh, I have something else. Let's leave it. I'll cancel it. No, 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 no. Why not Jesus? Oh. <laughs> Ooh. God, God, God. This is our Christian. <laughs> what else? I'm ashamed of it. I don't want to talk about it. What? About praying to 
I mean, I would read I mean, Bible. No, there's nothing to be ashamed. My question was to be not to like, it was just to put you in the spotlight. Yeah. That's it. It was not to make you feel bad. Yeah, there's nothing wrong in that. I mean, like, yeah, I did it because at one point in time, I was, I, like, I, I read the Bible Gita yeah. once, I read it twice, and then, like, I got a little bit of understanding. No one can get any good understanding of Bhagavad Gita, no matter how many times they read it, unless yeah. you have to achieve that kind of enlightenment. Yeah, where you can understand Bhagavad Gita. But I'm still learning it right now, also, even after reading it so many times. But then there was this stage where I did want to seek the te- preachings of teachings of other religion. And that's when I started reading the Bible also. Mm. Okay. Why did you start reading the Bible? What? Did you meditate after coming years? Uh, very, very little actually. I feel after the episode I released, I never did not do it. No, I did it a lot. Which one did you do? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can because a lot of people started asking me questions and I'm like, oh, I didn't do anything man over here. Uh, but, no, 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 no. I feel when there is, like what do you say, like when I went to India, I felt I didn't even have to do anything. Mm. everything was already there like whatever around me was already there so I was like I don't that's what I felt and then here also it's it's like that it's not like I don't I'm not doing it because I'm lazy or I it's just like uh, I didn't I didn't feel like yeah. shit, so I'm not forcing myself yeah, yeah yeah exactly but I do here and there obviously I do here and there uh, it's not like very intense like how I used to I feel in Barcelona I was super intense with this really? I was so intense with this <laughs> like I feel the last especially last one year I used to like Almost, almost, not every day, almost every day, wake up at like 7, 7.30. Yo, like yoga, meditation or just meditation. And then I still like do till like 9 or something. Two hours? No, with like taking bath and all of that, basically. Oh man, it's so good. Yeah, yeah. almost, no, it's, it's it's not every day, but then... Like yoga means like sitting at places or just... 60, 60% of the days, basically. Uh, what do you say? Yoga in the sense of stretching or breathing exercises? No, stretching, stretching. stretching. Yeah, 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 stretching, stretching. Yoga was the here and there. It was little, that I'm a little lazy, that I have to say. Meditation, I'm not lazy at all. But then when you do yoga and then when you do meditation after that, it's like this arm, it's level you get, man. You, that wow, that blissful thing is too good it is. I mean, for me, if that's how it is. I can't, I, other way I've tried. I want to learn how to do yoga, but you can try so many groups, so many people. Yes, yeah, so you can choose which is your path. It's not a living. Yes. Ah, art of living also there is one. <laughs> Are you trying to sponsor? No. Do you get any sponsors? No. Can you pitch any sponsors? Hey, please sponsor me. Moots. Or whoever you... Moots. So what? That means what? Brand, bro. Brand. So I don't know. It's a brand. How you know it's a brand? <laughs> Obviously, you think I will drink you. What? Ah, yeah, that's a stranger. It moves. Uh, yeah, it has nothing to do with this podcast, but you can, if you want to sponsor it, sponsor. I can talk about it, I can bring guests about it, I can show how you yeah, can use education, it. Education, education. Yeah, yeah, it's very important. It's actually, a very good pitch. Like, yeah. And uh, like, there's no better person in our circle, our fan circle, than like Sensor and Kumu, you know. To show us the, you know, the benefits, the use, what's one of the repercussions, the, what will happen if you don't, how to use it with different people, like everything. This, I think you're the best candidate. Uh. Facts on facts on facts. How are you feeling like after coming over the week? It's a long time. Nice, bro. Very nice. It's uh, nice to see all of you. But as your love for other way decrease, like before it was like a lot, yes. And you were, like, any chance you had, you would come. Oh, I would come to Abu Dhabi, yeah. No, now it's not, like because I know it's not very near also. It's not like, well, I can just take a ticket and come tomorrow. And I feel I've just grown and, like, uh, what do you say, I got very used to the setting of Barcelona because I was there completely for the last two years, no? Like, without going outside. So, two years, imagine, I'm just used to it. So, it wasn't like I was... I just got used to everything, like in a good way, you know. And I was happy also that, like, everyone was making me happy and everything. So I think that's one good thing. Bro. You met so many friends. Like, you're obviously here, you had a lot of friends in in Bombay also. You had a lot of friends, but when you went to Barca, you made a lot of friends and you kept making friends. Yeah, like sometimes you used to come and then go, but you would still be be friends with them. You just have contact with them. 
on that Netflix chain. Yeah, but they're all nice people. They, they're all it's like, all yeah, it's nice. It's a good no, thing. No, no, but they're all like, I mean, I see them like how I see you. Like, for example, if, yeah. like when you, when, like when, when I came here, you were in Mumbai. It wasn't like I never spoke to you when you were there. You know, I, I still used to like talk. Yeah. Uh, like when I went to Bathna, I still used to talk to you. I still yeah. used to talk to like Faheem or anyone, whoever is over here. So the same thing, when I'm here, I'm still, I don't message everyone every day, but it's like, I, I messaged all of them very recently, like, uh, hi, how are you, is everything very fine? So yeah, 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 and they also messaged back also, like, everything's fine when you're coming, blah, 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 so it's like, yeah, it's like, like, everyone is the same, it's not like, um, what do you say, in the beginning it was a bit weird, because I went there with the intention of, I want to find Indians, because whoever we know is like UK, Canada, US, Germany maybe, and they're all with Indian groups, no? And I wanted that, obviously, mm. I wanted that when I went to Spain. And when I went to Barcelona, mm -hmm. yeah, I want, yeah, because that's that's like your comfort zone. It's like, like when you think about it, it's like, what do you talk to someone else from another country? Like, what do you talk to them? Like, I mean, that was there for me in mm -hmm. the beginning. So I was just like, what else do you talk like with somebody from India, from North or South? It's easy, especially South. It's so easy because I'm so used to it over here. Then I went there, and then there were no Indians at all, like no Indians, like of my age and stuff like that, and. Uh, Naturally, that feeling just went and I just started seeing like people from other countries as humans. Basically, yeah, as humans. So you never consider the fact that you should like, like you will make friends with them when you go there. You were directly on the lookout for Indians. Not lookout. It's like I knew they'd be Indians. I knew I'll go to them directly. But then because they were in there, like naturally when obviously you'll go speak, hi, how are you? And then when, when I was just talking to a few people on the first day, second day only, no friendship, no bond, nothing. When I spoke to them, I was like talking to anyone, mm -hmm. like who I, who I like, obviously not to everyone who I talked that mm -hmm. thing is there. So it was like, I saw them as human. I didn't see them as Spanish, German, yeah. Argentinian, Italian. I saw them. Yeah. yeah. I saw them only as, <laughs> I, I only saw them as uh, humans. Like how I see all of you. So Last time I met in India. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Last year. Huh? Like you were alone. Exactly, yeah. But ended in Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like Adil and Ayman came, so that was also very yeah. nice, yeah. So I liked that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but now it like, and like, I think what makes you most happy, just in my perspective, yeah. obviously, I don't know, yeah. is the fact that you were always a very friendly guy, and then you got such good friends yeah. there. Yeah, sure. Very, very good. No, no, I'm very lucky, yeah. You actually like yeah. care about you, and you know, like when you were talking about people, like, uh, like, Someone who, one of your friends who encouraged you to start your front business, who encouraged you to do your podcast and all that's very good friends to have. I think that's what keeps you happy. Also. You have a very good friend circle. Man, it's not very easy, like, especially for foreign, like migrants like us to go there and make. Well, that's what I stopped looking that I'm a migrant. They stopped looking that I'm a migrant. I, I don't know about them. I have to talk about myself. I stopped looking that I'm this guy coming from India, coming from Abu Dhabi, or I'm out there, this person who's coming from Germany or who's local over there. I just saw them as another human, basically same, yeah. no difference. I think it's a culture that you know, makes everyone happy and makes everyone accepting. I guess so. There's a lot. Yeah, of yeah, yeah. Like you know, it wouldn't be, it wouldn't be in, I, it might not be the same thing if you go to some other country. Yeah. Uh, could be, yeah, yeah, could be, could be. So, maybe it's for Spain. Yeah. That's very nice. Thanks, sir. We shall to eat? Okay. Yeah? You have anything to say? You want to add anything or something? Or, or? Mm. No, I'm just very happy for you. Thank you. And uh, want to see you do more stuff now. Thank you. With you? In... <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Uh, in Dallas. Yes. Okay. Thank you. And I love you. I love you too. Sweaty hands. How many, how many do people take it over there? I go for hug, bro. <laughs> and then I wipe it in their back. Oh, sorry. I go for hug and I wipe it in their back. Say, I'm really... Yeah, what's she do? No one shakes hands? No, I don't shake. No. No, I don't be. It's very weird to shake hands. <laughs> yeah. Oh, they go to get hug, hug everyone. Yeah? Oh, that's nice. Yeah, that's nice, yeah. yeah. You do more than hug to hug. <laughs> what do you mean? Uh, No, like, like we... Like a brother. What do you think? Is a camera well. Like we brotherly hug. I don't know how. First of all, I don't know how well released this episode. <laughs> That's it for today's episode. No, no. It's not cutting with a tell. Say bye to this guy, and I don't know uh, what all you have learned about me. <laughs>